this bill. Uh, it's a, it's a, an important, it's, th these are small steps, but very important steps uh, to increase the efficiency and the effectiveness and the accessibility of these grants, uh, most importantly. I uh, just wanted to mention, uh, just from personal experience, uh, my father had passed away about 10 years ago now uh, from dementia and Parkinson's, and my mom cared for him for years before he went into long-term care. Uh, and I remember how difficult it was, especially towards the end. Uh, Dad would be doing things like getting up in the middle of the night, wandering off, and she couldn't even get a decent night's sleep. Uh, and we saw how it was affecting her health. Uh, even Dad, in his more coherent moments, was uh, saying to Mom, we need to do something, and uh, we can't keep on like this. Uh, the needs are going to continue increasing for care providers like them. Um, these uh, caregivers are becoming more and more important as the population continues to age. Uh, another epidemic is really facing us here. We talk about COVID-19 a, a lot, obviously, because this is uh, a tragic uh, pandemic that we're facing here. But there is another epidemic that we're facing, and, and that's uh, the epidemic we're facing with dementia, Alzheimer's, and other illnesses associated with long-term care or associated with aging. Uh, but the high costs with Alzheimer's and dementia are extremely expensive because of the high level of care that's needed and also because of the length of care that's needed. Uh, my father was in the nursing home for six years, more than six years uh, uh, in the last years of his life. And the nursing home was actually surprised when he came there at how far along he was in the illness and how long uh, mom had taken care of him for all those years. Um, so he could have been there for much longer yet. And so, and for much of that time, he couldn't do anything for himself. So uh, the, uh, again, the level of care was intense. Um, so I, I just wanted to speak in favor of this for that reason, uh, we need to be focusing uh, attention also on this, this epidemic. Uh, it's not only the, the compassionate thing to do, but it's also the most cost-effective way to do it because we need all hands on deck in this case as well, making sure we're providing the care that, that our seniors so desperately need. Uh, so thank you, uh, Senator Nelson, for bringing this bill forward. I know you have similar experiences with your own family, and I think this is something that is going to be touching. I mean, everybody's family, I think, is going to be touched by this in one way or another. Um, so thank you for your support.